Good morning, everyone. Here's a little lash update. They're not looking too bad. <laughs> Um, but today is Monday, so it's errand day. Um, me and my sister, the cat is sniffing the camera. Me and my sister are heading to the bank, the grocery store, and the pharmacy because I have to get a bunch of makeup that I ran out of. So, <laughs> guys, stop. So, basically, I'm going to do all of that. I'll take you guys along, um, get some footage in the store and then I have to edit some photos, do a little bit of homework, all that fun stuff, and yeah, so I'll show you guys what Gus is doing right now. He was currently, hey, let's see, let's see if he wants to look at himself. Look, look Gus, Gus, right here. Psst, psst. massive grocery shopping didn't vlog that much because literally our cart was exploding I couldn't even put the phone down um, but we're, I'm just heading to the pharmacy in the bank right now and then heading home I just did a very rough parking situation <laughs> okay so I am now back from the store took a lot longer than I thought so um, I was gonna have lunch when I got back initially but I think I'm just gonna I just doing like a little snack instead because dinner is gonna be ready in a few hours so I've got some avocado toast some yogurt and berries with granola and then I also got this new brand of soda water and it's watermelon lime flavor and it's actually delicious we tried it downstairs um, but Got a huge mess going over there, gotta clean that up. And then I also have the stuff that I got from the pharmacy, which I might do a little haul of later. So it is quite a bit later now, but I did promise a haul of the stuff I got. Um, so I'm going to do that now, even though it's a little bit dark, the light in my room is not great, but. So since I took my lashes off, I got a lash curler, some mascara, I got a body cream because I'm running out. I got, basically, I'm not gonna say it a million times because my sister already pointed out, but I'm running out of everything. So that's why I got all of this stuff. Brow pencil and brow gel. Concealer from e.l.f. And then I got the poreless putty primer from e.l.f. as well. It's one of my favorites. Um, a new foundation because mine ran out this morning. I got this lash serum as well, which apparently is really good. We'll find out. I don't want to spend like $100 on a lash serum because my lashes will grow back regardless, but this was like 12 bucks, so we'll see. And last but not least, I stocked up on my cream, which is the Neutrogena Hydro Boost Hyaluronic Acid Hi Sam, and the serum as well um, because I ran out of both of those. And then I also actually got the eye cream of the same line because I love that line. This line, it's the only line that can keep me from getting completely like dry and crusty skin during the winter and I get the worst dry skin in the winter. So this, this is the only thing, like at least in the affordable range, like they're $27 a piece, but the cream, the only other cream that's worked is a little tiny pot of cream from Sephora, which is like $60 and I can't afford to pay for that every like month. So. Um, I got these and these lasted me about like a month and a half to two months, so pretty good. So me and my sister are going to watch Vampire Diaries again tonight. Um, I'm going to edit some photos, so maybe I will edit those and then show you guys what everything looks like because I did take some cool photos today. Actually, give me a second. So I'm going to show you, I'm in my pajamas, but I'm going to show you some of the photos that I took today because it was a pretty cool location. Okay, so, so that, let's see, can you see, there, 
pretty cool pictures. Um, but yeah, I like the location, so I'll probably do a few more clips. If not, good night. <laughs> morning everyone so it is around 11 I believe I have a class at 12 30 um, I've had my coffee done my whole morning routine and gotten dressed um, I filmed a TikTok. I should have time-lapsed that for you don't even think about jumping at me <laughs> I should have time-lapsed that for you but I completely forgot so this is the remaining mess from that TikTok. but I will do a little outfit of the day so just wearing this uh, knit sweater, which is actually from my grandma. And then um, my plaid pants and my slippers with just some nice earrings. Nice and comfy for class, but basically I have to do class, um, but I'm going to be moving. So right now, I'm supposed to be getting my closet redone soon, but that's not happening soon. So um, I have this bin in the bottom of my closet, which is all my summer clothes. Um, so I think I might put it downstairs with the rest of my summer clothes and I'm going to put a little shelf in here. I'll, I'll show you actually which shelf it is. Um, this one right here, my brother's getting rid of it. Um, I'm going to put it in the bottom of my closet because I definitely need more storage. So I'll kind of reorganize and I'm also going to be going through my mom's closet and stealing some stuff tonight because she's getting rid of some stuff. So I'll take you guys along for that. Just thought I'd give a little good morning uh, intro. I look really pale. <laughs> I tried all my new makeup. But yeah, so I will see you guys a little bit later. All right, so I've just made myself some breakfast, or lunch, I already had breakfast. Um, I saw some leftover blueberries from breakfast, but I made this chicken pita. Ignore the sriracha on my hand. Um, I'm gonna dip it in some tzatziki, and then I have these sweet potato crackers to dip in it after I am done. So yeah. I'm in class and I'm gonna fall asleep. <sighs> I'm sure laying here is not helping the situation. <laughs> Almost done, and then it's time to do my closet, so. All right, so I'm done my class, and I'm just trying to take a picture of this dress. So it's from House of CB, and I love it, and I haven't gotten a chance to wear it, so I'm just trying to take a picture of it for my Instagram, but it just doesn't do it justice. It's frustrating me. So. <laughs> oh, that light is very blue. Alexa, turn plug one on. Okay. That's a little bit better. Okay. So I'm currently, as you can see behind me, going through my closet. So I moved in that little shelf in behind me. Uh, I've gone through a few things and I think I'm actually going to organize my closet as well. See if there's anything I can throw out um, or not throw out, give away. <laughs> and then I can kind of organize it a little bit better because it is a disaster. So I'm just trying to see like the best options here. So difficult. Okay. Yeah. Cue the time lapse. <laughs> my closet um, I do have to bring the blue bin over there down um, either in the basement or out to the shed for storage but I finished the closet I will show you guys that after but I'm absolutely starving right now so I'm gonna head downstairs and make myself some dinner I'm gonna do some homemade nachos for dinner and some salsa sour cream all that stuff not so healthy but it's homemade so it makes it better because I put the time into it um, so I'll do a little time lapse of that and then I will show you the closet when I get back upstairs and then I'm going to head to bed. So, see you downstairs.
so I'm back upstairs. Um, just gonna quickly show you the closet. It's hard to see in this light, I have to show you tomorrow. But basically, I put that under there. So I have my school stuff, camera equipment, purses, pajamas, suitcase. And then I color coded my clothes. I'm gonna organize up here once I get my sweats. Um, but yeah, so we're gonna watch Vampire Diaries. I got my little snackies here. Some sorbet. Some sorbet! <laughs> and yeah, so I'm just gonna end the night here. I'll see you in the morning. Good morning. So this morning I was going to take you guys Oh my god, why do I always look so pale on this camera? Um, so this morning I was going to take you guys with me downstairs while I worked out and did yoga. Um, but I actually started doing yoga and I got like a huge shooting pain through my back and I literally couldn't move. So I didn't end up doing yoga or working out this morning. Minnie, my mom's dog is here again and my mom's not here so she's crying. Um, but yeah, so I have two classes today. Um... My first class starts in, I think, like 20 minutes. So I'm going to grab some fruit just to have a little snack. And uh, I'll show you guys my little outfit of the day. Um, there probably won't be so too much, like, vlogging during the day today just because I have two classes back to back. But I am probably going up to my cottage tomorrow. I'm going to do school from my cottage for Friday. Um, and... I am going to do a bunch of shooting at the cottage. So I think I might actually do like a separate vlog starting Friday um, of like a cottage weekend vlog. But basically um, I need to pack for that. So I will probably um, vlog a lot tonight of me packing and picking out like a bunch of outfits for my cottage weekend because I do need to, like even though I'm gonna be in sweats the entire time, I'm going to be shooting a lot because I'm gonna get a bunch of content, um, change of location finally, so I can get some different types of content. So yeah, uh, I will take you guys along tonight to do that and um, whatever I get up to today, if I have time, I will definitely vlog it. Um, let's do an outfit of the day. I am the most comfortable person today. I'm wearing the pink white fox sweats because the PLT ones still have not arrived with this like tie-dye purple sweater. I literally look like I'm in my pajamas. I don't even care. Um, and yeah, so that's the outfit of the day today. How beautiful and gorgeous is that in the sunlight? Sam, you look beautiful. Okay, so I am currently just trying to pack for the cottage. I've got this situation going. Nice little suitcase there. Gus is helping me out. Gus, Gus! Do you want to see yourself? Look. Okay, so just watch this guy. Okay, ready? This is my arm. Just chilling. And... Wow! <laughs> oh, he's acting all casual now. And... here so I have an English class right now in about 10 minutes I believe yeah 10 minutes and then um, right after that we're just gonna pack the car up and we're gonna head to the cottage so I'm gonna do all my work up at the cottage um, I'm excited for a change of scenery because I have a few photos that I'm going to shoot I finally finished packing last night and I have some cute outfits I'm also hoping my brother and sister aren't coming up till tomorrow and I'm hoping that I have two packages coming. Um, one from a new company in Montreal and another one from PLT. So I'm hoping that those things come in um, before they come up tomorrow so that way I can shoot those as well. But I have some really cute outfits to shoot and it's super snowy up there, super beautiful.
Okay, so we're currently at the cottage. I got here and kind of just started on work, so I didn't do much vlogging, but I'm about, I'm about to head in the hot tub. So, show you a little view of the outside. Super pretty, we got a little sunset going, but yeah. Look at the, I have a red light across my, from the, the heat. Cute, ugh. About to have a shower and get rid of all this situation, but. Yeah, so basically I'm up here for a few nights. I am going to, we're just doing like a family weekend at the cottage, but I am going to do all my homework and get it all done while I'm here. That way um, I can figure it out. Although it's pretty, I don't know, there's no like privacy. So I am having some trouble actually doing the work. So I am just out in the hot tub here and this is the beautiful view from the hot tub. Oh, you can't really see over there, but the sky looks gorgeous. So... Loving that I literally have a teddy bear and a fan behind me with a half open closet, but whatever. <laughs> so, it is currently Sunday. I know I said I was going to vlog the weekend, but... I actually ended up doing homework the entire weekend, like genuinely 12 hours a day homework, which wasn't interesting at all. Um, normally when we go to the cottage, we do like family weekends and stuff and do games and all that stuff. So it's a lot more interesting, but this time I, I genuinely spent 90% of the time doing homework. So I decided to kind of just stop vlogging on Thursday when I got there. And then I'm going to finish off the vlog with a haul because my packages finally came. So, oh no, I'm missing something. I think it's in my sister's room. I'll be right back. All right, I am back. So the first thing I got um, in the mail, which was really exciting, was my sister got me a starting school present. So this is the starting school present. It is a little reworked Nike purse. It is absolutely freaking adorable. It's like um, the Prada bag style and I am obsessed. So yeah, this is definitely going to be making many appearances on my Instagram, everywhere else. I absolutely adore this. Um, the next thing, um, yeah, the next thing I'm going to do is actually, um, kind of like a PR package. Basically this girl in Montreal is starting a clothing brand and she just launched her sweater line and she sent me two of her sweaters so that I could make some content from her for her and I thought I'd include it in this week's vlog. So the first sweater I got is this one right here. So just says coffee on it and I literally love this one like this is the one that I wanted the most out of all the ones she showed me that were part of the line and um, I love the beige color actually this is like one of the only colors I don't have of a sweater and I like it's so soft super soft material and the little design is so simple and I just really love it um, so she wrote me a note um, it says, thank you for your amazing support. I hope this order will bring joy into your day. Can't wait to see you wear these crewnecks. Have a lovely day. So the company is called Pretty Artistic or, or Altistique. I don't know. It's Montreal. So, um, but it is super, super nice. 110% recommend. The second one I got, which is in a large, is this sweater right here. So it's the same kind of style sweater crew neck and it says beauty is in the eye of the beholder. So that is definitely going to be making many appearances on my Instagram. I really, really adore this. Um, even actually this would match together. Cute, cute. So yes, I definitely, I like love, 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 love both of these sweaters. Um, I will definitely be leaving her information in the, uh, bio, in my bio below. Um, or no, not in the bio. I will definitely be linking her information in the description below because these are super warm, super cute, super soft, and just such cute sweaters. And I love supporting small businesses, especially ones that are, um, up and coming. So next... I've been talking about this for an extremely long time. I ordered my Pretty Little Thing sweatpants, I think, like the beginning of January before school started, hoping to get them like the first week of school and they got delayed. So they actually refunded my shipping, which I was really happy about because it took so long. Um, but yeah, so the first ones I'm wearing right now, um, 
They're just like these brown sweatpants. They say PLT Sport right where? Oh, right here. <laughs> Um, I'm gonna do like a little try on portion so you'll see like right here um, me trying them on but I'll show you so I basically got all the same style of sweatpants just all in different colors so these ones right here in black um, I PLT can be hit or hit or miss but if you know what you're looking for as far as like material and stuff um, then you can definitely like get really good stuff from them so I got the black sweatpants I got the same ones in gray as well uh, or not gray what am I saying <laughs> green as well and I actually really I'm really excited for this color because I find it's like a color so it's kind of adding a little bit of color to your outfit but it's also very neutral as well so for me, like when I'm purchasing things, I don't like to get things that are too bright just because it's hard to rewear them a million times without people noticing. Where this is kind of like neutral and bright as at the same time. Then I got these ones right here. They're like a blue tie-dye sweatpant. And I really like these ones a lot. These ones are actually uh, a different style than those. They're similar, um, but it has like a little bit of a different waistband. And the sizing was from 0 to 12 instead of uh, extra small to extra large. So I got them, um, I think in a... I got them in a 4. So, and then the sweatpants I got all in mediums, except for the brown ones that I'm wearing right now, which are in small. Um, I'm usually, like, if I'm doing true to size, it would be small. But I like my sweatpants oversized, so I always go one size up. And then... There's one more thing. Where are they? There they are. And then last but not least are once again the same sweatpants. Oh wait, actually they're not, I don't think. Are they? Yeah, they are. Um, same sweatpants but in gray. These ones for some reason fit a little bit larger even though I got them in medium, so I'm not really sure why. Um, maybe it's a different style but that looks the same. I don't know, it's weird. Um, but I'm not complaining. They're still super soft and super comfortable. Um, and I'm super excited to be able to style these sweatpants every day of school this week. So be prepared that um, next week's vlog will be all sweatpants outfits. Hopefully I'll be able to make them cute. But yeah, so once again, um, pretty artistic. I will leave their information in the description below because you should definitely check them out. Um, but that is the end of this week's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I honestly am at the point where I don't even know what this week's vlog consisted of because it's been a while and I feel like I've been all over the place this week. But, uh, I'm looking forward to see you, seeing you guys in next week's vlog. Um, if you have any suggestions for videos, definitely leave them below. And I will see you guys next week.